Aptera's Gamma was recently on NBC News. They mentioned that the car overheated driving uphill. I wanted to clear up some things about this. We got some statements from Aptera about this, but essentially the cooling system is not complete on the Aptera. This is not a production build. This is a snapshot from 18 months ago. So let me go over their statement. This is the most recent one. Dear Ambassadors, following the NBC News segment last night, we want to assure you that Aptera vehicles have cooling for the motors and inverters and are incredibly capable. What you saw in the news was just the result of Gamma's cooling system not being completed after its jam-packed schedule in Europe, away from its home and engineering team. That had never experienced a real issue up until this media visit. Due to the hot summer days and extreme hills, it's clear that this cooling system must be completed before Gamma performs any further media visits. We'd love your help spreading the word. We're looking forward to showing up Gamma. So another statement, this is Chris from Aptera also. Um, the only thing that he mentioned extra was Gamma is receiving slick upgrades to show off more production capabilities. I'm excited to show those upgrades in the coming weeks. And he also said that they're going to finish, basically finish the cooling system before they do any media visits, which is smart. So basically cooling system is not in place. So don't freak out about this. This is basically an incomplete car at this point. It's just a, it's a prototype, it does look like a production unit, but it doesn't have all the production parts like cooling, for example. So don't get freaked out, that's fine. Let me know if you have any thoughts or questions. Yeah.